We are here for Good Gideon's Cookie of the Month, and it's July 1, and there is a virtual queue. So we'll see what the wait is. We're here at Flight Pig. They have two new offerings for July. One is a uh, shrimp ceviche appetizer, and then one is a bacon uh, old fashioned. Old so we're trying both, and we'll let you know. Which one are you wanting? Well, I'm not big on old fashioned, so probably the ceviche. But I'm kind of picky with my ceviche, so we'll let you know what we each think of it. Yeah, yeah, and we're outside. What do we have? So we have the St. Augustine Old Fashioned. It is St. Augustine bourbon, bacon fat wash, local petal honey, Ooh, orange you. and, oh goodness, Anagostera bitters. <laughs> Sounds good, do you want to give it a go? Uh, we're not big old fashioned people, but we wanted to show their drink of the month. St. Augustine Old Fashioned. Oh. No? Well, they say old fashions get sweeter when you get to the it's bottom. It's not my thing, but Andy may like it. Oh, yeah, it's not my thing. <laughs> well, supposedly as the ice melts and it incorporates in the sugar packet, it gets better. Okay, this looks amazing. Wow. So we have here the Key West Pink Shrimp Ceviche. It is Key West Shrimp so Smoked Watermelon, Sasacho Peppers, Tomato Vinaigrette, Hot Honey. And does this look good or what? And I don't know if I said shishishko. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> All right, here's both the ones just so you can see. Flavors of Florida. All right, I am ready to give this one a go. So they're whole shrimp. All right, let's check it out. It's a ceviche meets polite pig barbecue smoky flavor. Yeah, that's really good. But yeah, I see watermelon, tomatoes, hot honey, and a tomato vinaigrette. That's really good. Give it a go. Well, so far I like the watermelon. And the presentation is just awesome. So definitely interesting ceviche. There's no red onion. It's more like a smoky flavor, but I'm, I'm enjoying it. That's the rating. You can definitely taste the smokiness. Okay, and our family from St. Louis. Hello, hello. They're trying an awesome side, which we've always wanted to try. Tomato and watermelon salad. Looks like a pickled onion, watermelon, feta cheese. Kind of like what we had at Epcot. They're really good. All right, let's try the two. Do you like it? We loved it. Kind of different. That's a good one. It's a good flavor combo. Did you want to try the mac and, and you guys, cheese? No, I'm fine. And you guys got mac and cheese, and we've had the tater tots. Very All good. good. All very good. All right, and the poutine fries. And two. Okay, we're not going to buy this, but Deluxe Burger for July has the flavors of Florida. They have a lime garage burger and an orange bird shake. Mm -hmm. That looks good. Oh, pork belly, pepper jack, avocado, jalapeno. That actually looks good. Orange bird shake. Vanilla gelato blended with orange syrup. And there's the balloon. But we are not trying this, but that's what they have. 
Okay, at Chef Art Smith's Homecoming, they oh, have a new thing that. for July. That looks good. Key West Shrimp Cocktail. Oh, avocado, I see mango, shrimp. Okay, we may actually have to try that later, maybe. Nope. It's water. It's water. I got candy. Looks good. Oh, check this out. We may have to get this. All right, we are at Amaretz and new for July. Look at this, Indiana Jones. I mean, I Petite did cake. We may have to get that. That's crazy. But then they also have orange cream puff, orange bird dome cake, and a strawberry spritzer. So that's what's new at Amaretz. Here it is. Look at all the little beauties. They got enough. The hat looks really cool. Oh, look at that. That looks so good. Nope, that's all. Uh, to go. All right, look what we have here. We have the Indiana Jones cake from Amaretz. It's got the hat. It's got a whip. It's got the pockets. Let's see if anything's in there. Alright. Anyway, we're all gonna dig in. And it was Macy's idea. <laughs> Alright, we're enjoying our Raiders Indiana Jones cake. Not Raiders, our Indiana Jones cake. It's pretty good. It's got almond and I think even dates in it. I'll put it up right here what's all in it. And then we have a queso appetizer. Everyone enjoying their cake? And then Kevin informed us it is Canada Day today, so happy Canada Day to our friends up north. That's right. I took one small drink and it burned all the way down. <laughs> and what was the name of this again? That is uh, Bam's Barnstormer. And you're not real big on it? Nope. No. Nope. It, it's... Well, I just took a sip up the top. So. Ken has a beer flight. That looks really good. Fantastic. Of what? I don't remember. You'll have to tell us the best one of the three. And then that looks like pink lemonade, which actually sounds it's really good. It's pink lemonade and watermelon. It's very good. The drink is good. Oh, that's good. Okay. All right. I'm going to try the Bornstormer. Oh, no. I lost the line. It's the Barnstormer, so it's heavy uh, whiskey or bourbon. Not too bad. So you're eating the hat, Macy? Let us know how the hat is. Is there something in the middle, I mean, it's so cool how they made a hat out of that. All right, we've had this before. It's usually pretty good. And we have the queso chip and chips. Oh, the pickles are good, as I remember. All right, Ken's enjoying the nice colored beer. That's my favorite color for a beer. This is queso chips, and you have a That's a pretzel. And Andrea's enjoying her lemonade. That's, that's not bad. I think I may need to give it a little stir or something. We're walking over to Gideon's Bakehouse right now. We're trying to go get some cookies, which we have been waiting for for about, I would say about since 11 o'clock. So oh yeah, it's been a while. Cookies. Oh, we've been here four and hours. It's almost three o'clock now. All right, we so gotta get in this line and get out of here. And it's a pretty long line. The line looks pretty long. All right, we're about to get back in the line. Kevin's got the camera. I got the audio. We're getting in line. All right, so we have the uh, pup cakes from Sprinkles, and we will show you when we get home. We'll give Luke and Lorelai each their own pup cake. Okay, we have the roasted coconut caramel and then the key lime pie. That looks good. All right, so we have the cookie of the month that we're trying first, which is the coconut caramel chocolate chip cookie. Oh boy. Oh, 
Oh, it looks good. Oh boy. Good thing you have napkins. Okay, I'm just gonna take a bite. Try to hold it by the coconut. Mm. Oh, wow. Oh, it does taste like a Samoa Girl Scout cookie. Oh, does it? Mm hmm. Mm. All right, let me see if I can get in for a bite. Yeah, it really does. Okay. Yeah, I'm usually not huge on coconut, but that's good. All right, so one for one. Right, the cold brew is, what's the name? Orange, oh, Orange Mocha Nitro Cold Brew. I think we had this last year. Or we had something very similar. It was an orange. But it's always the same base of cold brew, which is excellent. So. I don't know what will. Basically, any cold brew you get there is really good. It's good. You can taste the orange. Here, see what you think. So I, I guess I didn't scare him. Telling him about my girl who was I'm not big on orange. It's okay, but not my type. But I'm going to do this because it's a melty mess. This is the key lime chocolate chip cookie. Oh. I'm excited to try lime in a cookie. I see Lime the salt in the too. She, no. Oh, she asked, like, kind of looks like the chocolate chip. Oh, started, and I was like, my brother, it's like, you know, Lawrence works mm. a lot. Of they have really good cookies. It's crazy. Oh, okay. you know, like she's always busy. She works nine. I don't care for the lime, but the cookie itself is more moist and soft. And I was like, but she's amazing, and like, you know, than the other. Nephew, All right, like so that's the cookie of the, of the month. The <laughs> coconut, I believe, is through August. This one, I think, is just July. So the first bite, it almost tastes like a lemon cookie. And you're not sure you like it, but yeah, it's good. I mean, you throw chocolate, this many chocolate chips, and you're going to have a good cookie. Probably not two of our favorites, I don't think. But they're good. So it's hot. We've been here for a while. So we're going to get going. So thanks for coming along. Yeah. And join us next time. And special guest outro is Macy. Right. Right here. That's what I was saying. Thank you for watching the video. Please like and subscribe. Bye. 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 Good job. Yay. All right, who's ready for a cupcake? You ready? Here we go. And she's helping me, brother.